has invited Macedonian leaders to talks on Friday to try to bring an end to the political crisis in the Balkan country. People have been protesting against the government for the past five days. They're angry at the president's decision to stop investigations into more than 50 public figures involved in wiretapping scandal, including some top politicians. Well, with more on the protest planned later, we can speak live now to Sinisha Yakov Marustic from Skopje. These protests seem to be gaining momentum. What are their demands? Well, the protesters are demanding a withdrawal, a immediate withdrawal of the president's decision for pardoning. They're also demanding his resignation, uh, withdrawing of the decision uh, for elections for June 5, which the government insists will be free, but uh, the protesters don't think so, and the formation of experts' government that will be tasked to prepare the country for truly free elections. Like you said, the protesters feel angry and outraged by the president's move. They blame him and the former prime minister, the leader of the main party, Vomorod Dapamanev, doing everything to undermine the, the uh, EU brokader uh, crisis, to, uh, crisis deal from last year. Well, that's the public response. The EU says it summoned the political leaders for renewed talks. What's been their response? Well, the leader of the main ruling party said he will attend. Now the big question is whether the opposition leader will attend as well. People here, here feel uh, betrayed, the opposition supporters feel betrayed by uh, the happenings from last year, saying that uh, with uh, the former prime, ministers, uh, prime minister there cannot be uh, talks. So they've extended several additional uh, requirements before they send uh, the opposition leader to renewed talks. Uh, they're saying that uh, they need uh, firm guarantees that the special prosecution formed last year to investigate high-level crime will continue its work. They demand uh, that uh, formation of a special uh, section in the existing courts in order to uh, uh, be in charge for the proceedings that uh, and cases raised by the special prosecution because they don't believe the special courts. And another demand is for the rep representatives of the civil sector that have also taken part in the protests to be also included in the political talks and to have a say. Okay, Sanisha Yakov Marusic, thank you.